Hey friends! So in my weekly emails, this month I've dedicated June to talking about accessories. So every week we have like a little project that you can do in your wardrobe and I'll give some sort of ideas that might help you to simplify and strategize what's going to work for you. And I also went for my annual eye exam last week or the week before, so I'm thinking about new glasses. So I thought I would um, create this video and give uh, five just ways for you to think about how to choose glasses. So the first consideration um, is having to do with the size. So when you look at how wide it is next to your face, it should be pretty well lined up. And the biggest mistake that people make is getting like, these might look a little tiny bit wide, but getting them so that they're really wide next to your face, that's the biggest mistake I think that I see people making when they choose their glasses. Now, if you're going for like a big old oversized look that's a style, then, you know, that's a different thing. Um, okay, so the second consideration has also to do with size. And that is, um, so when you're talking about this, the size up and down here in this field, the down usually relates to whatever happens to be in style. But the thing that you want to be careful of, and these are like almost not right, is that this, uh, this top part, you want it to be lined up about with your eyebrows or you want to see your eyebrows above it. The third thing has to do with shapes. Again, this top piece, this is just an opinion. It's something that you can do. It's not a rule. The other two are rules about the, the width and the height here. This is just a, an idea. If you choose a shape here that is roughly the shape of your eyebrow, or it could even, like if you have an eyebrow that has multiple shapes or different directions, you could just line up with one of them. Uh, that is guaranteed to be flattering on you because that shape is already on you. And a, similar to that, one nice way to choose this shape would be to use the shape of your jaw. Just a thought. And the final thing that I wanted to mention has to do with color contrast. And this is huge where I see people getting this wrong and it's not the best. So the color contrast has to do with how much darker or lighter is um, your, the glasses frame compared to the rest of the colors on you. And you can fudge a little bit but it's going to be best if it's about the same amount different from your skin as what your hair is. Because that's your primary level of contrast. So that's why when these big black frames come around, like right now there's some really big blocky ones and there have been um, in the past too. Um, you just, if you have black hair or really dark hair, dark brown, that's fine. That's going to look great on you. And because it's going to contrast with this, it's going to provide the same amount of contrast with your skin, whether you have dark skin or light skin, it's going to provide the same amount of contrast. But if you put those on me, I'm going to look really frumpy and that's just what it does. And it's Frumpiness is a lot of times caused by something being out of harmony. And, uh, and it might be okay for sunglasses, but I wouldn't recommend that for your glasses that you see your face through. Um, okay, so those are my five considerations for choosing your glasses. And now I have a question for you. 
I have been thinking and wondering if um, if you or anybody that you know would like for me to offer a, a service where you could send in pictures of frames that you're deciding between and I could help you with that. So I'm, you know, that's obviously something that I can do, I have done, and it's not something that is on my website now um, as being available. But if you think that you or someone you know would be interested, would you please leave me a message below this? And, um, and I will leave a link that you can get on uh, my emails for the projects if you'd like to. Thanks so much for watching and have a wonderful day.